John Singleton Copley was an American painter born in Boston, United States on July 3, 1738. He died on September 9, 1815 after a successful career leaving behind a legacy of masterful portraits. As an artist, John Singleton Copley became associated with two different artistic movements, Neoclassicism and Romanticism. He is particularly known for his innovations in portraiture, which captured the wealth and status of colonial New England's middle-class subject matter. Copley's portraits were notable for their carefully chosen objects and detailed settings, which often revealed important aspects of his sitter's lives. John Singleton Copley was influenced by the European art that he studied during his time in London. He also had close friendships with other artists, including the famous portrait painter Benjamin West. Copley founded his own painting school in Boston, which impacted many aspiring artists of the period. John Singleton Copley was born in Boston on July 3, 1738. His parents were involved in trade, which was common in the North American colonies during that period. Copley's schooling is unknown, but he was well-educated, and as early as the age of 15, he was already able to engrave in mezzotint. His future stepfather, who was a portrait painter and engraver, and his association with many craftsmen, possibly contributed to his learning to use the paintbrush and engraving tools. In fact, a book of Copley's studies of the figure at the British Museum shows he was already making anatomical drawings with care and precision. Copley became friends with Thomas Johnston's son, who later became a painter himself. Copley's artistic opportunities at home and in his town should be emphasized, as they proved instrumental in laying out the foundation of his academic proficiency. However, Copley himself, and some biographers who took him too literally, often overemphasized the bleakness of his surroundings. In his earlier letters, he complained that there were almost no examples of art to learn from in the country, save for a few poorly executed prints. However, his own portrait's excellence wasn't accidental or miraculous as it had a solid academic foundation. John Singleton Copley continued to create art despite the challenges that he faced in his later years. When he moved to London, he started to receive commissions from aristocrats and high society individuals, including Sir Joshua Reynolds. One of his most remarkable works, The Death of Earl of Chatham, is known to have taken him almost three years to finish. Copley's portraits are known for their expressiveness and meticulous attention to detail, making them highly sought after. His talent and skills earned him recognition, and he became a member of the Royal Academy in 1779. Copley passed away in London on September 9, 1815. In conclusion, John Singleton Copley was a gifted American painter whose work is celebrated for its attention to detail and innovation in portraiture. Despite his humble beginnings, Copley displayed incredible talent from a young age and continued to develop his craft throughout his career. He not only became a master of neoclassical and romantic art, but he also founded a painting school in Boston that influenced many aspiring artists.